What's up, Plane Crash Survivors? Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and welcome back to The Forest. Hell yeah, we're back with The Forest. Um, I've got a really, really interesting episode today. Uh, I'm going to be working on doors. Um, I'm going to call them... We need a name for the doors. Uh, my gut instinct is to call them super doors, but I feel like that's kind of a cop-out just because I can't think of anything more creative. Uh, so I'm not really sure, but let me go ahead over here and show you exactly what I'm talking about. Uh, pretty much the one I built last episode, uh, but I'm going to try and put them everywhere. If you, if you missed last episode, this will give you a little bit of, um, of an idea of what I'm going to be doing today. So the problem with these doors, okay, the problem with these doors is they don't line up properly. Or at least when I place them down in ghost image form, they don't line up properly. They'll line up with one side here. Let me show you right now. They'll line up with one side of this building, but not the other. And just in case you're wondering, well, Cage, why you got to make these doors? What's the big deal? Um, I'm really aggravated that I'm not finishing parts of this base. Basically, basically, uh, I'm not finishing walls because I want to be able to get log sleds in and out. It's it's of utmost importance that you can get log sleds in and out when you're building. I mean, that's just, you know, uh, believe me, you're really helping yourself out. So the way to do that is I don't finish walls. But the problem is I want to finish these freaking walls. It's getting on my nerves. So what I did was over here, I made this wall and it, it came out perfect. Um... The reason it came out perfect is because I built the whole wall at once. It was all a ghost image, and I made it work, okay? Now, that's awesome because now I can get things through there, and it looks like a cool door. I'm done with these little dinky, crappy doors, man. Like, we're going to do real doors from now on. But the problem with that is, uh, when I do the ghost image form, they don't line up properly. So let me show you what I, what I mean about that. Um, these are defensive walls, by the way. If you go on, if you go on the start, the beginning part of the wall, it, it's fine, right? So I could start right here, okay. But once you get to the other part, it it doesn't it doesn't go next to. That's as close as I can get to the wall. All right. So that that's the problem. Let me get this out of the way really quick. So here's the deal, though. Um, you see right here, you see right here. Check this out. So you see how I, how I just did this? I did it like that. I came over here, and I kind of placed it like I I like. You see the way it is right now? It's not lined up at all, right? Look at that. It kind of snaps into place a little bit. Um, it's not perfect, but it's good enough. I, I, like, I learned that from over here. This one didn't do it, though. I'm not really sure why this one didn't do it. Let me kind of play around with this one. This one did it perfect. That's how I figured it out. Okay? And it kind of, like, snaps into place. I really like that. Again, it's not, it's not like, ultimately... Per wow, that's really... Actually, that's really close to being perfect. <laughs> so, I just, the only thing I don't know is if it's going to, like, line up properly once, once the build is finished. But we'll see. All right, so you do this, and you do this, and look at that. Dude. Dude, all right, this side's a little off. That's okay. It's a little off, not 100% perfect, but it's really good, and I will be perfectly fine with it. And I want this to open up that way. I want this to open up. I don't want anything opening up into the hallway. Uh, oh, okay, so this might be a little bit of a challenge here. Uh, put that there. Put that... Nope. See? Alright, so the, all right, so this is a little bit of an issue here. Because of the way this is built. I might not have an... Uh, you know what? There's no fix for it. This one's just going to have to be kind of messed up a little bit. Which is, you know... I, I really don't love it, but I don't have an... It's got to be this wide. That's, that's as wide as it's got to be. I can't make it... I guess I can make it a little bit wider? I don't know if that would help. Let's just try one time. If it doesn't work, then the hell with it. I, I gotta, like, you know... One of my downfalls with, with these games is I try and make everything perfect. And it really slows things down. So we'll see. What I'll do is I'll bring it all the way out to here this time. Oh, see, that didn't... Yep. So that's not gonna work. Alright. Fair enough. Let's get it back to where we had it originally. And just say it's not perfect and I, and I am okay with that. Ooh, lightning. Some lightning here, people. All right, so we go right out like this, as close as we can get it. Boom. Now I w I made this a little bit different, so let's see if that helps. Yep. Cool. Oh, perfect, perfect. You see what I did? I kind of made it a little bit more squashed. Like I used less logs going vertically, and because I did that, it. Oh, mm, that's a pretty big gap. That was a good night's sleep. Um, I'm ready to start building, and you know what that means. It's time to save the game. I'm making a big leap here 
Because if this doesn't work out the way I want it to, I could find myself in a bad position uh, trying to make a building here when I've already saved when I've taken down what I've already done. So uh, we'll have to see how that goes. Uh, let's go ahead and kill some rabbits. That's what I do. Man, I am like a rabbit mass murderer. Like, when the rabbits finally, finally do take over the world, you know, like Planet of the Apes, except it'll be Planet of the Rabbits, um, I'm going to... They're going to get me on some... I'm in trouble. That's all I'm going to say. I'm in trouble. They, what the hell did I just do? That was weird. It was like I ate something. I wonder if I ate some, like, mushrooms or on the ground under the base. Sometimes sometimes that happens. Uh, I should probably make a... a, a freaking... Uh, what do you call it? Skin holder or whatever the, th whatever the thing's called. So I could, I could save their fur. I don't know. Um... You know what? I'm not going to do that because I, I didn't, like, plan it, and there's not a lot of room here for that. Uh, yeah, I'm going to take that. I'm going to take one more. Oh. Oh. Wait, why does that raw rabbit look green? It looks like it's no good. Huh. That raw ra that rabbit looks like it's green. Do they all look like that? Hold on. All right, so that's a, that's a dried rabbit. What about this one? No, they don't all look like that. I wonder if that rabbit's going bad. I mean, it said raw rabbit. I mean, if it's no good, it'll tell me it's no good. So I'm not really overly concerned about it. But yeah, let's go put some rabbit fur over here. Um, yeah, I didn't really plan to have any kind of like fur holders over here. I, I mean, I, I I guess I could put one at the end here, maybe. I, I don't think I'm going to do that. I mean, I don't think you need a ton of rabbit fur. Like, what do you use rabbit fur for? Well, let's, let's take a look. Damn, I have 10? I didn't know you could hold 10. All right, yeah, I mean, I've made everything. The only thing I can make with the rabbit fur now is the worm suit. So I don't need 50,000, you know, rabbit furs because, you know, just don't need them. Uh, yeah, I mean, this thing's full too. Okay, well, I guess it is what it is. It'd be nice if you could turn it into something, you know, consumable, something that you use. I don't know what that would be, but anyway, so when I, when I last left off the last cut... Um, I was kind of messing around with this, and through painstaking redoing it over and over, um, I've got it like this. I, I don't think I care about that gap. I think I'm going to leave it, because it does look um, a lot better. So we're going to leave that one alone. And then this one, we need to see if this is going to work. And it's not. Oh, boy. Um, I don't know if I care enough to redo it. Let me try and redo it. So I'm going to try and redo it once and see if I can get it right. I said I was about ready to build and I was I was a liar. I was a dirty, rotten liar. Um, I redid this one. Uh, there's no gap on that side. No gap on this side. This one looks pretty good. Um, it looks pretty lined up. I like that one. I redid this one. And this one took forever. No gap. No gap. And it looks good. It's up in the middle. There, those like These cross things are not like crossing into each other. Um, that's looking good. right? Yeah, it's pretty lined up. I like it. Okay. So now we just have to do this one right here. Do we really need this one? Well, we need either need that or a, a, a wall. I mean, what are these two rooms going to be even? Like, now that I think about it, what are these two rooms going to be? I definitely want an armory down here. But what was the other room supposed to be? Was this supposed to be a kitchen? I could do a kitchen. Yeah, maybe we should do a kitchen. This could be the kitchen, and this could be the armory. Okay. All right, yeah, let's put a door in here. Why not? We've come this far. Let's see if we can go the whole way and make this work. All right. First of all, we got to get rid of this. I don't think I'm going to do a bar and grill outdoor thing like I used to. Um, I've done that before. I don't think I'm going to do that this time. Um, although, I could make I could make this the kitchen and then have the deck a little outside eatery. Maybe. I don't know. I'll think about it. Um, the armory needs to be bigger than the kitchen, so I will probably make that the armory. There's nothing to be said about, you know, you, you get the kitchen, you come to the armory, and then you go outside. There's no reason you can't do that. I mean, this is a barracks, after all. This is where people sleep, eat, and this is where we keep our weapons. Uh, what did we call it? The Serpent Barracks. Now, I could have called it the Cobra Kai Barracks, and it, it did cross my mind. Uh, but at the same time, I thought it was a little on the nose. So I decided to go with the Serpent Barracks. Okay. And this one's going to be a little tough. You know, we should probably start from this end. All right, so this has got to be lined up, right? It's pretty lined up. Not totally lined up, though. I like it lined up in the corner, to be honest. Yeah, all right. And then this is... Ugh, this is 
freaking damn log sleds? What idiot put these log sleds here? Goodness gracious. Give me a freaking headache. <laughs> oh, I am a funny guy. Okay, so let's uh, go ahead and take that. And like that. And come on. Okay, it lined up. It looks good on this side. Looks good on this side. So let's see if we can turn it into a proper door. Now, which way is it going to open up? It should probably open up into the armory since the armory is going to be a bigger room. So we do uh, that. Oh, no, this isn't going to... I don't think this is going to work. What the hell? It looks like... It's like two pieces. What the... That's weird. It looks like it was two pieces. I'm not sure what happened there. That shouldn't have happened like that. All right, let's try again. All right, like that. Ah, see, sometimes it doesn't it doesn't snap into place. It only does it sometimes. So, uh, let's try it on this side. Want to get as close as you can. There we go. Come over here. See if this works. Hmm. Yeah, this is gonna take some. I don't know why these aren't connecting. It's like it's almost like they're they're two separate walls. I'm not really sure what's happening here. Let's try that. And that. There we go. And you know what? I think that's probably just about perfect. Comes through here a little bit. That's not a big deal. It's lined up. It's lined up. It's in the middle. It's good. It's going to open this way. Let's go ahead and save the game. And then we're going to build up these things. And hopefully we've... Hopefully... Because, like, you never know with this game, right? Just like when I went to put down the ghost image and the ghost image shifts when you build stuff it might shift so there's no guarantee this is going to work um i'm prepared to take an uh an imperfect build here though just to get these things to go the way just to be able to use these doors because man these doors are so good like i really love them like from now on when i build you know next season or whatever i gotta remember about these doors because it's legit that is legit. It's probably my favorite thing I've ever come up with in this game. And it's one of the very few things I haven't seen like other people do. I'm not saying no one's ever done it. I'm sure people have. But I've never seen it. So, alright. This door is gonna... Alright, so the way we look at the doors... Is... When you have the cross-section things... You're, and you're facing those, the door will open out. Okay. So right here, we have the cross-section things. It'll open out that way. That's what I want. Cross-section things open out that way. That's what I want. Cross section, open this way, that's what I want. Cross section, open that way, that's what I want. Let's go ahead and build. Alright, we're going to build the front door first because, um, I don't know. Why not? Whoops. Okay, please work. Please work. Please don't shift after I built, built you. Uh, looks pretty good to me. Oh, wow. Dude, that, I'm actually kind of shocked. And how well that came out. You know what I, you know what I'm gonna do? Since we're gonna be building inside a lot today, I'm gonna go ahead and turn on M131 so you guys can see properly. Um, I can't believe how much that lined up. Like that's it's kind of freaking amazing. Wow. <laughs> it's perfect. It's mother effing perfect. That does not happen often. Not in this game. Not in this game, my friends. That is a, uh, a wonderful, wonderful thing. All right, let's go ahead and grab these, and let's build some more. Make sure they're all going to... I mean, it doesn't mean they're all going to work like that, but so far, so good. Every time I build in this game, my base is just... Like, I always find out something new, and it, it just makes my bases even better. All right, there we go. I'm trying to right-click because I'm thinking of um, the infected. I've been playing a lot of the infected lately. All right, so I'm just going to take an extra log. All right. Let's see if that looks like it's lined up from the inside. Um, phew. Phew. Unbelievable. Dude. Dude. You know, at this point, guys, I'm kind of at a loss for words. I, I didn't think it was going to come out this perfectly. It just doesn't make any sense to me. My brain can't handle what is going on right now. Like, I was fully ready for, like, okay, once you finish the build, it's going to shift and it's not going to line up. Something's going to go wrong. You know, it shouldn't be this easy. You know, blah, blah, blah. 
but man, it is um, it's working out. I guess it's I guess it does do that sometimes. It's a good day. Right, maybe need for this one another thirteen. Uh, yeah, it should be two more. All right, I'm just gonna assume that one's gonna work too. Let's build a, let's build the last one. There we go. Close you. This is fantastic. This is how you build. This is how you build bases, guys. There is no reason, absolutely zero reason, to make a regular door when you can make these. Except it's cheaper, I guess. But whatever. If you make it, if you make these doors with the ghost images, it's even easier than what I did here, and I proved here that you could knock out any wall, any wall, and replace it with one of these doors, or any door. We're gonna do something I don't normally do here. We're gonna break the sleep schedule, and we are going to sleep. We're gonna stay up through the night. Um, I will stay up through one night. I hate breaking my sleep schedule, but it's okay. I will do the best to brighten the videos as well. Hello. All right, there you go. But yeah, we need some skulls. So that's what I'm coming over here for. One, two, three, four. That's all I can carry. Excuse me. Coming through. There you go. Oh, uh, boy. I did have, um... Uh, allow building destruction off. I guess I'll turn that on. Although, I kind of like it off. <laughs> but, you know, I can't just have them, like, being forced to stay out there the whole time. That would just be boring. So... Uh, you know what? I might actually let them break down my wall, see if they do it. I'm kind of curious. Now, the reason I do want to play through the night is because I want to, like, see what we could do here with these, uh, with these light sources. Um, this game has a real problem with light sources. It's just, it's just the way it is. Uh, there's, there's a certain amount of light sources you could do. You could do, um, the one cool light source is a bonfire, but it's super duper expensive, and it'll break after a certain amount of time. The standing fire does a really, really good amount of light. It's a really great light source. But you have to light it every time you come around. And that's just, like... Could you imagine me coming down this hallway and have to light these things? Like, oh, forget that. I'm not doing that. It's stupid. All right. So, those are the light sources there. And then the light sources you do not have to light are... The skull lamp, which barely gives off any light. I mean, it's a candle, really. The ceiling skull lamp, same thing. Plus, you can't put it on the floor. And there's also the chandeliers which you know i don't know i guess they're not too bad the problem is i have too high i have too high walls so the fact that the chandeliers all the way up there is kind of you know it, it doesn't do as much as i would like it to do uh let's go ahead and put on regular uh original and see how bad it is here yeah that's not too bad with these things on the sides and the, and the chandeliers on top that's not too bad i'll have to see what it looks like on youtube because youtube always makes everything look you know um darker than it should all right, so let's go ahead and turn back on M131 so you guys can see. And we're going to go ahead and get some more skulls. Hopefully I'll be attacked. We'll see. I mean, I'm under attack right now, but I just kind of ignore them. I mean, I do kill them because I, I need their skulls and I need their bones, but, like, not all the time. You know what I mean? Like, I just spent all the time. Because I decided to build where I built, which is probably not the best place to build, um, it's been fun, but the thing is, they never stop. Like, I killed 20 of them, and 20 more will just take their place almost immediately. Because it's right at, a, you know, their main base. So, I knew what I was getting into. It's fine. One, two, three, four. Also grab some bones. There we go. Because um, that'll probably make some chandeliers. Hey, what's up, buddy? Yep. Oh, you want to follow me? You sure you want to do that? You sure? Are you sure? No, you're not sure. Get the fuck out of my face. Um, I need to make some more. Uh, I need to. De I need to dedicate an entire episode to traps. But then again, with the traps, I don't know if it's worth it. I mean, I could set up like a million traps out there, and they'll set off a million traps, and then they'll just keep spawning. So it's kind of, yeah, it's kind of a, a losing battle because they'll just keep spawning. I don't think there's any end to it. All right, so we're gonna put on original. We're gonna put this away. And damn it, sticks. I need freaking sticks. Alright, I can't have this. These mother... Put your headphones on. If you have kids in the room, put your headphones on. Family, anything that... Uh, don't uh, don't like cursing. These motherfuckers. Get the fuck out of here. Total piece of shit. 
Yeah, he's fucking dead. Fuck you. You're next. Sorry, this game really, really burns me up, like, with these guys. I don't know why. It's just the way I am. Grab some sticks while we're here. Hey! Dickhead! You didn't build shit. Is all you know, know how to do is destroy... I guess they did build some, some tents over there or whatever, but... Give me a break. What a jerk. Alright, we done? We done. Okay. Let's grab some sticks while we're out here. We'll just get a nice 20 sticks. That'll be good. Um, oh, I want, when the hell am I going to be able to one-shot the, these things, man? Like, let's take a look at the book. Let's look at our skills really quick. So my strength's only only 42. I think the problem with my strength is I got the chainsaw too early. So my strength hasn't been going up. When your strength gets to a certain point, you'll be able to one-shot the sticks. And that's when you're a real badass. Right now, I'm just kind of a... I'm like a little baby. little helpless baby. Oh, God. All right, there we go. 20. Beautiful. Let's get in here and make some lights. Sorry I keep switching between M131 and normal, but I need norm or original. But I need original to know, you know, how much light I'm really getting. Right now, I just put the lights on both sides of all the doors. And I will put them wherever else I'm going to need them. Okay, there we go. Actually, that's not bad. Maybe, maybe I'm not giving these things their due. You know, that's actually not too bad. Should we make some, uh, seal Yeah, let's put the ones on the ceilings. I just don't think they're gonna be that good. But, and they're super expensive. Look at these things. Look at these things. Eight freaking skulls. Oof. It's like two trips. Alright, I'm gonna need, um, some M131 to place these where I would like them to be placed. Because I can't see shite. Alright, so... I want that right in the middle, right there. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Right there. Man, we're gonna have to kill some more guys. I need some more skulls. I need some more mother effing skulls. And yes, I remember the burn the two bodies of the people I just killed. Totally remembered. Look at me go. Um, I used my uh, <laughs> my hairspray and uh, lighter to make a blowtorch to get them to get them lit. And we're just going to kind of chill here. So one problem with me not sleeping during the night, and it's kind of a big problem, is I don't think the trees will respawn or the rabbits will reproduce. I think you have to actually sleep for that to happen. Uh, I could be wrong about that, but I, I think that's the case. But, you know. All right. So there we go. And now we just need some more skulls and more bones. we got to go out and get them. And these freaking punk asses. Yeah, maybe maybe the, maybe the I'm not giving the, the, the skull lamps their proper due. Because... I, you know, just singular, they're kind of weak. But when you put a few of them together, they don't seem that bad. So, might have been a little hasty in my judgment. All right. Four. Grab a bunch of these. Mm. Oh, God, there's... See, the thing is, if I... Yeah, I'm going to leave them there. Those bodies ain't going nowhere. If I have, ch if I have time... Before the end of the episode, or, you know, after I'm done recording and before I move on to the next game I gotta do today, I will burn those bodies. It's just hard, because I go to burn them, and then 50 more guys will show up. It's like, okay, you know, it's just cool. I mean, I, I do enjoy that, but there's only so much time in the day, right? Look at this dickhead. Look at this, look at this guy. By the way, if you swing with one hand, you do less damage. Okay. You come with me. That's another skull right there. God, I love these doors! They are the best! Alright, so there we go. So let's put this back to normal. And see how this looks. It's not bad. It's not bad. Like I said, I'm... Oh, let's put this away. It's not bad. I'm gonna have to see it on YouTube. Like I said, YouTube darkens up videos. Especially when you, when you watch them on your, um... You know, on your phones. So... I, it's, this room probably needs some more lighting, but I think it's in pretty good shape. I think it's in pretty good shape. I, I, I'm just not sure if the if the if the sh the chandeliers are worth it. I mean, how much light is coming down? It seems like this lit up this corner pretty well. So, all right, I think I will leave that here. Um, 
I'm not sure what I'm going to do next episode. I think I might want to do more lights. I'm, I'm not really sure. We're going to have to see. Uh, it will either be setting up the armory, the kitchen, or doing more lights. Maybe we'll go upstairs and work on the bedroom. Honestly, I don't know. We'll just have to see how I feel that day. I am just really happy these doors came out so good. Can you guys, can you guys give me a like if you think these doors are freaking dope? Like, I mean, the only thing the only thing that's bad about them is they take up more room when they're open. This door t doesn't take up any room. But, you know, and because it, it closes automatically, I guess. But still, um, I think these doors are just fantastic. All right, guys, if you haven't enjoyed the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. Wow, I never finished that one. Okay, well, done now. All right, see you next time, guys.